Following her win at the International Girl Pageant 2023 in the United States of America a month ago, 17-year-old Mathabo Matlu has been chosen to take part in the prestigious New York Fashion Week. The South African-born teenager is an ambassador for the Always Sanitary Towels who works hand-in-hand -hand with Footprints Foundation and assists underprivileged schools by donating sanitary products to end the period poverty in the country. Bathabo says apart from aspiring to become Miss South Africa and Miss Universe one day, her goal is to become one of the greatest lawyers in her country. And indeed, Bathabo Matlu joins us now live from Hoteng, South Africa to unpack her journey. Hi, uh, Mathabo, thank you very much for your time. Hi. Congratulations. Um, how does it feel to represent your country at the New York Fashion Week? I know it feels so amazing. I think I've dreamed about this for a long time and for it to actually be happening is so exciting and so honorable. What was the first reaction when you got the good news? Well, honestly, I couldn't believe it because as I've already said, I've actually dreamt about this for a long time. I didn't think that a, just a girl from, from South Africa could, you know, be thinking about this and then eventually actually be doing it, you know. So I was very excited. I was very honored. And I actually was so emotional. And uh, how do you think this opportunity will have an impact on your career in the fashion industry? Of course, your future aspirations for the other pageants uh, that you'd like to partake in. So obviously pageantry and modeling are two different things. And right now I am busy with pageantry. So this is a first step for me in the modeling industry. And I'm hoping um, I do well and I work hard in order to get to different levels and get to higher levels and make myself proud, make my family proud and make God proud amongst all. Hmm. Um, I mean, I'm sure the young girls, women, you know, and even men listening to you tonight uh, all over Africa, Mathabo, um, how did you get to where you are? Um, did you overcome any challenges along the way? What can you tell us? What's your story? I think for me, I come from a background of just prayer and really having faith in God. And I think that's a big thing for me. And that's how I got to where I am right now. But above all, I started somewhere where I did not have confidence, where I did not believe in myself. And all of this was just a dream. Um, luckily, my parents found a school for me to attend um, when it comes to the modeling industry and pageantry and things like that. So with the skill that I've learned over the years, I really um, am thankful to the school that I am going to. So it wouldn't have happened overnight. You know, if you put your mind towards something and you work hard, really, you can get there. Obviously, you are not unaware of the enormous importance of, you know, the New York Fashion Week. Um, uh, obviously, this is also important for you as a South African. What do you think or how important is this for you uh, for what it will do back home? You know, as a, an ambassador of South Africa, how important is this for you, for your people? You know, I think with this whole thing, it's just it's not just me going as myself, but I'm going there to represent my country. I'm going there to represent the amount of power that South Africans can have. And it's also a message that I want to send to whoever might be listening that you can be successful in a foreign land. And even though I'm not at the top, but I'm definitely starting somewhere. And this is my start. And it's not just in South Africa, but it is in a foreign land. It's in the United States of America. So you can really do well at home. You can do well in your home country and you can do well in a foreign land as well. Are you also looking to see to, to have this rub off on the image of um uh, and reputation of South African models and, you know, uh, fashion globally? You know, I think it's also very important for the whole world to see what South Africa has to bring to the table. Um, I want people to really understand that we are not just African, but we can show what African really means. And we can also show our Africanism in a different country, in a different continent, you know. So I would like for the fashion industry and models as well to be African, you know. I want us Africans to make it. And yeah, so I think it's very important for the fashion industry to include Africans, to include girls from South Africa, to include girls from different countries, and not just girls that are just from the United States of America. Hmm. I tell you what, Mathabo, I look forward to seeing you uh, become the Miss South Africa and of course future 
uh, Miss World or Miss Universe one day. So you go, girl, and uh, keep up the good work. Mathabo. Thank um, you so much. Thank you very much for your time. Mathabo Matlu uh, joining us from Hotung, South Africa. She prepares for a participation in the prestigious New York Fashion Week. She recently won the International Girl Pageant 2023.